Hey guys, today I'll show you how to set up billion mail so that you can send and receive email messages. So billion mail is free and open source email server for bulk email marketing. So this is a good alternative to power MTA and you just need to have a domain or domains and I really suggest a server with open part 25 like dart node so i will be using dart node dedicated server if you want to send bulk emails so let's get started so okay if you don't have a dedicated server you can use a vps but if you have huge list of leads try a dedicated server i can recommend dart node dedicated server because they have an open port 25 so okay i'll just set my host name and reverse dns first since i already have a dedicated server so let's go to dart node and go to network and go to reverse dns and i have added my reverse dns mail.webshanks.org and we will set our host name. So now let's connect to our dedicated server. So I have connected my dedicated server. So I'll just click new terminal console. And I still have a local host as my host name. So First, I'll just update my server. And let's change our host name. So to change, you just use this command. We will set this as mail.webshanks.org. Just paste it here and set your host name hit enter and we will reboot our server okay now our host name has changed so let's check if our host name is correct okay so our host name is mail.webshanks.org so now let's Continue. Now we will map our DNS. So just follow this guide. We'll add a record. This is for IPv4, IPv6, and our MX, DMR, and our SPF. So I have already mapped this DNS on my Cloudflare, or rather, I have connected Namecheap to my Cloudflare so that you can see this. Clearly. So I have added a record for mail and our root as well as our IPv6, our MX record, our DMARC, and our SPF. So just follow this guide right here. And now we will install billion mail. So this is just a one command. And be sure you have git and we will install get first so just copy this command and we will install billion mail so just copy this command right here and we'll wait for a few minutes and we have successfully installed billion mail so we'll, we'll copy this address right here and We'll go to our browser. So just click advanced, accept the risk and continue. Okay, we will log in using our login credentials. And now welcome to your billion mail 
dashboard so first we will go to domain and we will add our domain and let's add our domain so this will be webshanks.org set a domain quota and also for mailbox count you can set the limits here and for our dedicated IP just copy your server IP before so let's go back and copy this IPD4 and we'll set a host name that will be mail.websharks.org and all set let's confirm and we'll add an SSL for our domain just click not set and if you have an external SSL just paste your SSL here and if you don't have just click apply free certificates and we'll just wait for a few minutes okay so we have successfully issued an SSL certificate for our domain now let's go to DNS records now we only have DKM left to map and let's go to DKM so this is your DKM you will copy this one we will add a text record this will be a text record paste the name and just copy the value so just paste it here and click save okay now let's verify our dns and we have an old green for our dns records and now let's close this one and we will create a mailbox so just go to mailboxes click add mailbox let's say this will be miles and for display name let's say miles and set a secure password and choose a user type and just click confirm so now it's time to test our email server but before that instead of using an ip to access our billion mail we will use our host name to access our billion mail security so go to settings and you already have this is actually instant once you have added a domain so now you can securely access your billion mail so go to our host name and we'll just copy this one this is the security path So just go to your host name with HTTPS, paste your security token, and hit enter. Now we can access our billion mail security with SSL. So for the credentials, it's the same. And let's log in. And we'll just close this one. So, Billion Mail has Roundcube Webmail. Let's go to our domain and go to Roundcube. And let's go back to Billion Mail. So, let's go to Mailboxes. So, this is our username. And I'll just copy the password and we'll click login. Now we have our own webmail. We can start by testing our 
email server. So let's go to mail tester. Okay, just copy this. Recipient, let's compose. Paste it here and we'll use an email template. Okay, this will be meeting. Let's change this to miles. Okay, we'll send. Let's go to mail tester and let's check our score. And we have a 10 over 10 score. So let's try to email Gmail. I just copy the email template quickly. Okay. And objects. Okay, so let's change this to miles and click send. Okay, let's go to Gmail. Okay, we have received the email. Let's try to reply. Click send. Let's go back to our webmail. Okay, we receive the email. So now we can send and receive email messages. So for email marketing, just go to email marketing and add a task. This is the same as Brevo or MailChimp, except that this is just a self-hosted email server for email marketing. So you can set up your email here. So just create a display name, subject, and for recipient, just click create and upload your prospects, leads, or subscribers here. And you can create a template as well. And what I like being mail is they have an association for IP warm-up system. So this is actually good to limit your sending rate. You can also send a test email to see what it looks like in your email. And you can also set up an SMTP relay. So let's go back. And this is how to set up Bigin Mail. And I hope this tutorial will be useful to you if you want to start cold email marketing or you want to self host your newsletters and will not use monthly paid services like MailChimp, Brevo, or other email marketing software. So if you have any questions, just comment them down and I'll try to answer them all. If this video helped you in any way, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you on my next video.